This house in Alva just came on the market yesterday and we listed it at $1,075,000. It is priced really well and it's a special home. I want to show you all of the cool details here. First of all, let's soak in this lush native vegetation and privacy. This is the three car garage and guest house. And then this super cute enclosed porch. So this home was purchased in 2018 and has been extensively remodeled since purchase. I'm excited to show you all of the things that have been done here. I mean, for instance, just on the front porch area, let me zoom this out. We have new impact rated double doors, stack stone, all new lighting, cypress on the ceiling, more cypress beams in front with more stack stone, whole house gutters with leaf guards, landscaping, irrigation, pavers, stucco. It's a concrete block structure, but before the house had um, siding on it over the stucco. So that was all removed. The home was stuccoed and painted and you have PGT impact rated windows and doors. Look at these cute log cabin chairs. All right, you wanna see the inside? Let's go check it out. Right, stepping inside, this entire home has been added onto with a structural engineer. They pushed out the living room space to add additional couple hundred square feet and make this great room larger and have room for the dining table. So you have this nice big open layout. All of the kitchen cabinets were replaced. And we have black stainless steel appliances with the LG door and door that the double oven granite countertops nice raised panel wood cabinets with the rope detail and granite if you're into a white kitchen i just have to say this is beautiful in a creamy white with the oiling around the rope detail it gives it a whole new look just putting that out there but these cabinets are beautiful there's trim and under cabinet lighting above cabinet lighting there's a granite composite sink with a Delta faucet that is tied to Alexa. So you can actually tell Alexa to tell Delta to give you water, to turn the water on and off, all that good stuff. Before we head outside, I have to show you this feature with the Murphy bookcase. Opens up into the primary suite, which has been remodeled and expanded. You have the bay windows here, giving it a little bump out of extra space. Access to the lanai with impact rated sliders. Step into the bathroom. Dual sinks and a sauna. And then into your bath. Freestanding bathtub. And this amazing shower enclosure with frameless glass, two shower heads, well, multiple shower heads. You have the two heads and the wand, three controls, ceiling to floor tile. And then into the dressing room, LED lighting, lots of natural light as well with these privacy shades that are top down, bottom up. I love those. Impact rated, sliding glass doors, exposed beam, lean-to enclosure with pavers. Now these pavers aren't set on sand. There's concrete underneath, so they're staying right where they are. Never be sinking on you. And the outdoor kitchen with stack stone and concrete countertops. This has a flexibility to have whatever kind of grill here you want. You're not bound to having, you know, the GE monogram built-in grill that nobody likes. You can have your Blackstone, your Traeger, whatever you want. Ventilation up here, nice fan to push, push any of that exhaust out. There's storage. There's a compartment here with electrical where you can have your mini fridge, your beverage cooler. 
There is a whole home generator. All the mechanicals are over here on the side of the house where there's a concrete pad for the RV parking. And there's a whole home generator with a 500 gallon tank. There's a whole home reverse osmosis system, new HVAC systems with all new ductwork, UV sanitation, like top of the line. This flat screen TV is 86 inches and stays with the home. It's got a swivel base. It's custom, made to fit. This pool was just installed in 2019. It's a saltwater pool. It's heated, has an integrated spa, shelf seating, tanning ledge, these laminar fountains, like the jets. And then what's really cool is there are LED lights that you can program for different light shows and they can pulsate with the music changing. Now these screen enclosures, the screen enclosure that's here has super screen on it. So not a single panel was lost in the last hurricane season. You have these extra large picture windows. So if you can see there's one here, one here, here and here. So you have these unobstructed views and you don't have the bars all over, you know, like especially the, the horizontal crossbar that blocks your view of everything. So you get to look at nature and how beautiful everything is out here, how private it is. This is the Cypress Creek that runs in the back. It is Gulf access. You can see the drawn boat back there. You can go under the little, the little bridge and head out to the Caloosahatchee River. There's a stocked koi pond Let's go get a little closer look at that. Check this out. You have a koi pond, metal mesh over it to keep the, any predators out. I think there is a otter that like to come up here and feast on the koi. Do you have access to the Kalusahatchee River via a John's boat, John boat like this? And this is the Cypress Creek. Beautiful, peaceful backyard. And then this fenced in dog run on the side. Cannot buy mature oak trees like these. You have to purchase a home that's got these on them. Some of these oaks have been here for hundreds of years. All right, so we got the expanded guest house. It, with its own private lanai, there's a privacy screen here, so you can sit out and... Now check this out. Living room, kitchen. It's got its own electric meter, its own air conditioning system, electrical panel. Now this room technically does not have a closet but it's used as a bedroom and it has egress. It's connected to the bathroom, which is a full bath, a new vanity and flooring. And there's all new baseboards, paint, lighting. And then this one has a closet with its own egress. 